up guys, the phenomenal AJ Styles and you're watching Red Oak Live. What is going on guys? Put a life back with another video and today we have all of Decade of Dominance Series 1 and oh boy am I excited. We picked these up from Walmart. If you guys have not already, check out the Toy Hunt video. Link in the top right. Insane Toy Hunt video. I really suggest that you guys go check it out. But yes, Decade of Dominance Series 1, Natalia, John Cena, Mark Henry, Mar uh, Randy Orton, and The Undertaker. We're going to be reviewing them and unboxing them in this video. I'm so excited. So without further ado, let's freaking do it. Okay, guys, we're going to start off with Natalia first. I'm very excited for this figure. Of course, we've been getting a lot of newer, updated-looking Natalia figures, but this is more of like a an earlier look for Natalia right here because, of course, of the the different hair color and the younger look. Very cool. Comes with the podium. The Divas Championship. What the heck? That is crazy. I'm so excited. There's a look at the top of the packaging. Very, very nice. If you guys look closely, you can see Natalia through the years getting younger and then older, a bunch of different periods in her career. There's a look at the bottom, Decade of Domination. Again, you guys are going to see them all reviewed and unboxed in this video. Natalia, Mattel. There's a look at a younger her again on the side, Elite Collection, like a like a modified Elite Collection logo right there. There's another look at her on the side. I like the, like the little paint in the back. It reminds me of AEW. Pretty sweet. And then there's a look of her on the back if you guys would want to pause the video to read that. Other people in the series that you will see unboxed in this video, Randy Orton, John Cena, Undertaker, Mark Henry, and Natalia. She comes with the open interchangeable hands as well as the fisted interchangeable hands we're also getting a pretty big accessory here this is a uh belt podium which is pretty cool yeah pop it right there and as well we are getting a divas championship we haven't seen this title in the longest time i only have one of these championships so it's going to be pretty cool to add another to the Bredo live collection pretty sweet looking title it says divas on the front with a pink fully silver plated very very cool oh my gosh w logos on each side awesome looking strap again it feels weird to say divas championship oh my god i just haven't said that in such a long time but there it is basically what you do you pop that closed in the back you get your podium with a little indent on the top you pop it right on there and then that's the reveal of the divas championship Natalia with a very young look here, looking really, really nice. Let's take a look at the head scan. Very cool. She's got a smile going on there, looking pretty awesome. And then you also do have like a sort of like a reddish brown hair type right here, which is interesting for a Natalia figure. Like I said, a younger Natalia. Pretty cool. Moving down to the attire. It's a big navy blue attire. You got some white and gold lines going through. You see a little white part right there, which is pretty cool. Very nice looking attire. Moving to the back, mainly blue, as I said. And then moving down on the sides, you can see some minor silver stud design, which is pretty sweet. And then moving down to the boots. A lot of detail on these boots, actually. Or the kick pads, I should say. You got some blue with some white background, which is pretty sweet. And then also, at the top of the boots, I'm not sure if that's her socks or if that's her skin right there. Top it off, she does have the white soles. Now we are going to jump into John Cena, the Doctor of Thugonomics. I'm super excited for this figure, adding another Cena figure to my collection. A lot of people complaining that this figure is inaccurate. I honestly couldn't care less. I think it looks amazing. I love the jersey. I love the bucket hat. Looks freaking sick. There's a look at the packaging. Very, very similar to Natalia. Decade of Dominance. You can see the different pictures going throughout. Younger Cena, older Cena. There's a look at the top. Bunch of different pictures of Cena throughout his career. I, lo I love this entire series. The entire concept of the Decade of Dominance is just so awesome. Like, people that we're seeing, like, today, but in, like, old Older looks. That is just such an awesome concept to me. There's Cena right there. See the modified inner, um, Elite Collection on that side. And there's another picture of Cena right there looking awesome. Pretty sweet. There's some info on the back. If you guys like to pause the video read. Other people in the series got Randy Orton, John Cena, Undertaker, Mark Henry, and Natalia. He comes with the hang loose hands, so you can't see me hands, and the open hands. We're also getting a pretty tiny accessory here with these brass knuckles. Says Word Life on them. Looking pretty sweet. Pretty cool bucket hat as well. I'm a big fan of that. Fits the Cena figure great as well. I'll make sure to show it at the end with all the accessories on it. Here is the Doctor of Thugonomics chain. He's got the little padlock on the bottom with the chain going around. And then we also have the green number 33 Celtics jersey right here. Pretty cool. You got the white 33 on the front, mainly green and on the back it also says 33. Here we have the Doctor of Thugonomics John Cena. Very stern looking head scan right there. I'm not sure. I don't think we've seen this head scan before. I think this is a brand new Cena head scan. Pretty cool. I'm a big fan of it. He's got the, you know, not longer hair, at least for John Cena. <laughs> pretty cool. He's got the jack torso. Uh, pretty neat armbands right here. He's got the fully black armbands, which is pretty sweet. You could see his compression shorts coming out of his shorts a little bit there with his black belt, his blue 
jean shorts, jorts, which is pretty cool. I like that. And then you also do have the John Cena and Shane McMahon style trainers, white laces, and white soles. And like I said I was going to, here we have John Cena with all of his accessories on looking like an absolute stud. Look at that. Pretty sweet. Okay, guys. Now moving into Mark Henry, his nation of domination mark henry attire pretty freaking cool it comes with a big set of dumbbells or a weight bar a 45 pound bar which is pretty sweet i'm a big fan of that awesome looking uh, mark henry attire decade of dominance very similar packaging not going to do too crazy much there's the images going throughout pretty cool there's a picture of henry on the side elite collection logo there's another picture of henry right there looking like a beast there's some info on the back if you guys like to pause the video read up in the series randy orton john cena undertaker mark henry and natalia he comes with the open interchangeable hands as well as the fisted interchangeable hands we're also getting this pretty sweet looking hat right here. You got the green, yellow, and red flag colors right there. And the hat, I think it's a brand new mold. It's looking really good. It fits the Mark Henry figure very well. And then we also got this big weight set right here, which does have pins on each side. If you guys haven't seen them before, I've seen plenty of these. But what you can do, I'm not going to do it right now because it's a little tough to do it behind the camera. But you could take these pins off and you could take these weights off. And it could just be a bar, which is pretty cool. Pretty neat accessory. Here we have Mark Henry looking very, very awesome with this brand new head sculpt. I think it looks amazing. Got the stern Henry face, the nice looking beard going on, buzz cut head. And yes, here we have the hat popping it right on there. I think it looks way better with the hat. I love just the look of that. It looks great. Here we have the big singlet that Mark Henry always comes down to the ring with. Normally it says World's Strongest Man on the back. This is an earlier Mark Henry right here, which is pretty cool. And then you also do have the same red, yellow, green, white, and black colors right there, which look pretty cool. Again, comment down below what, uh, what kind of flag that, uh, what kind of flag has those colors because I know a flag does. But yeah, those are really nice looking right there. They have, both, have them on both sides. You got the extra large Mark Henry knee pads as well as the signature Elite Mark Henry Boots. Okay, guys, here we have the Viper, the Apex Predator, the Legend Killer, Randy Orton with interchangeable heads, interchangeable hands, as well as an arm sling. Very, very cool looking figure. Decade of Domination, very similar packaging. You guys can get a look at the pictures right there, as well as the ones on the top as well. Again, guys, if you guys are looking for these, Walmart exclusive, uh, Randy Orton Elite Collection, pretty cool. Another picture of Orton right there. I, I really love this paint splatter design. That is so cool. There's some info on the back. If you guys like to pause the video to read, other people in the set, Randy Orton, John Cena, Undertaker, which we still have to review. Don't worry, guys. Stay tuned. Mark Henry, Natalia. He comes with the open interchangeable hands, as well as the fisted interchangeable hands. We also are getting an arm sling with this figure, which is pretty interesting. Pretty cool. You got the blue little bottom right there, which you can do. I'll grab the Orton figure here with not showing too much. You can get the arm right there. Slide it in just like that. Have that hang on his shoulder just like that. This is the interchangeable head scan that we do get with the figure. And I gotta say, look at that. Holy crap, does that look like a young Orton. Oh my gosh. The hair sp spiked up. The smirk, the the smug look, that is Randy Orton. Look at that. That is crazy. And then, of course, we do have the main one. This is the one that I'm going to be personally keeping on the figure when I have it displayed and or in my bins because I honestly prefer this one because they have released a Legend Killer Orton before with this same exact head scan, so I think I'm going to go with this head scan uh, to be on here. Of course, I will interchange them, but yeah, this one's looking great. I love the hair, how it's like sweated down, wet, and just basically hanging down like bangs on his head. It's pretty freaking sick. Oh my god. And I love the facial expression. Just basic. Means business. Ready to kick your butt. There's a look at the torso. Love the torso choice. Pretty sweet tattoos, of course. I have my more updated looking Randy Orton Elite right here. You guys can just get a look at that tattoos and how they're different. Back tattoos pretty similar. This one's just a little more tiny. But yeah, pretty cool. I just want to get that figure there to show a little comparison. But yeah, pretty sweet. Oh my gosh. He also does have the white wrist tape. And I'm loving these biker shorts. These are so sick. It's sort of like a navy blue with yellow lettering going throughout. It says Orton right there. And then also you got the uh, yellow lines there. And then the back it all also says Orton. That is just so classic. Look at that. Just Orton. That is so cool. Oh my gosh. So awesome. Moving down, he does have the navy blue kick pads, or not kick pads, knee pads with the black boots. And last but certainly not least, we have Mark Henry. No, we have Mark Calloway. We got The Undertaker. Holy crap. Am I excited for this one? Uh, not sure if this is based off of his Survivor Series debuting attire, but it is very similar. If it is not, it is very freaking similar. I'm so freaking excited for this figure. 
Oh my gosh, they have released one similar in the WrestleMania 31 Elite. Uh, they there was a Kane and the Undertaker. It was WrestleMania 31 Elite set. Um, but yeah, not the biggest set, but still pretty cool. Uh, very similar figure, but yeah, I, I don't ha I don't own that one, so this is pretty cool. Pretty similar package. You guys could see some images of the Undertaker on the top. There's a picture of the Dead Man on the side Elite Collection. Another picture of him right there, looking demonic. There's some info on the back. If you guys like to pause the video or read, up in the stuff for the last time, Randy Orton, John Cena, Undertaker, Mark Henry, Natalia. He comes with the open, interchangeable hands, and I'm glad that they're giving him these because these look sick. Fully black because they're black gloved. He also does have the foreign object holding hand. Here we have Undertaker's tie, very very cool, in like sort of like a two piece right there, which is pretty sweet. You guys could see the faded lines there, and then if you extend this, you could put it all the way over his neck. We also do have the dead man's hat with the gray wrap around. Otherwise, pretty similar to all the other hats that we've gotten. We're also getting a cloth, yes, cloth trench coat right here, which is massive. Look at that. I'm so glad it's not rubber. The rubber ones are so annoying and so bulky. So yeah, I'm glad that this one's cloth. It's looking great. Fits the Undertaker amazing. Speaking of the Undertaker, here we have the Undertaker. Very sick, imposing, big, scary, creepy looking figure. There is a look at the head scan. Very cool. You guys can see the eyeshadow a little. Just a demonic looking head scan. He's got the beard, the mustache going on, the weird looking hair. Long, brown, very cool. There's a look at the torso. I'm a big fan of this. I have to mention that on the sides here, going over his shoulders, you guys could see that it partially goes over the ball joint right there, and then you could also see the buttons going down. Very, just overall amazing looking torso. There's a look at the back of it. You can see all the different wrinkles. Here's a look at the arms. You got the Undertaker black gloves, and this is actually a separate piece right here. You could actually remove that if you took off the interchangeable hands. Moving down, he does have the black tights which are looking pretty sweet. And then over his black boots, he's got these nice little gray covers, which add a little more color to the figure. I'm glad that those are on there. And then he also does have the black soles. Okay, guys, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, this has been Decade of Dominance Series 1, exclusive to Walmart, Natalia, John Cena, Mark Henry, Randy Orton, and The Undertaker. I gotta say, my favorite one has got to be The Undertaker. That one is absolutely insane. So crazy detail. I love all the other ones, but The Undertaker definitely stands out, in my opinion. But yes, guys, this has been the Decade of Dominance Series 1. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Like, comment, share, subscribe to Brutal Live, and I'll see you guys next time. Brutal Live, out.